All right, so I'm back again. <clears throat> so let me see if I could clean up a little bit of what I said in the first video. What is the purpose of suffering again? That's how you learn to be spiritual is suffering. Not all that, you know, that frilly stuff they teach in the church. That, you know, there's there's a way to get to there's there's a way to get to joy. But there's also a reason why the book of Revelations is not taught as much in the church. Already had nobody teaches it. <clears throat> you know, they might have read it themselves, but the reality is when they go to school, they are taught everything they need to be taught. But when they start teaching and preaching, they teach you based off your level. They teach you based off your level and what it is you're looking for. They don't go to school for you. They go to school to know more than you so they could teach you, but they're not teaching you everything that they were taught. They're teaching you based off what you want. Therefore, you're not getting the message. You're not truthfully getting the message. This is why a lot of people during the week, they slap their children around. They slap their kids around. I'm sorry. You're angry about something. And this is only some people. Other people, you're probably, you know, doing any, anything that any kind of narcissistic person could think to do. Now, we all have some kind of narcissism. But some people got it really bad. They treat their families like garbage. They treat their families like garbage. Okay, spirituality is suffering. It is both physical, okay, get it? Like, like I'm patting my arm. Physical, it is also up here. <sighs> my favorite part was when people say, oh, try to deal with the real world. But I live in here first. I mean, I'm up here first. It's hard to get out of here. I don't know what it means to get out of here. When people say try to get out of here, I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. I see the real world. Look. Yeah, there's nature. There's other people out there. Yeah, I see all that. But I'm also here. But I spend more time here. That's the crazy part. I'm always thinking about something. This idea called I, this I am stuff, that's up here. Without this, you couldn't even say I am trying to get out of my head. <laughs> First of all, that I am is stuck in your head. It's hard to get out of your head. What does that mean? People just want to avoid thinking. That's all it is. So what do they do? They, they, they try to get lavish. Okay? They try to get lavish. Which is creating more suffering. That's all it is. You can do that if you want to. That, that's your job. I'm not going to tell you that it's wrong for you to do it. It's wrong for me to do it. It's wrong for other people to do it. That's fine if you want to do that. So if you were to look at the previous video and say, no, light, 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 life is about happiness. It's, it's about getting everything you want. You could do that. There's nothing wrong with you doing that. Just don't tell me that I'm missing out because I'm not. Don't tell me I'm missing out. The purpose of the video was to say for anybody that's trying to figure out how to go about spirituality. Number one, it's suffering. It is our antecedent. Suffering was here before I was born, before anybody that's alive today was born. Those are facts. Those are facts, okay? It's suffering. Spirituality is number one, suffering. Suffering gives us purpose. Why? I still try to try to figure out that answer. Where, who was the first person that suffered? Where did suffering come from? We don't know. We just know that, that us spiritual, you know, people do any phony thing they can to try to avoid suffering but they go to church they go to church am i passing the church itself no we're talking about some of the congregants the pastor most likely knows better but that's not true about all of them that's not true about all. some pastors know better it's about community spirituality number two is about community so that, that's what the topic of this video should have been, community. Number three, number three, after you built your community, is how you respect the earth. So when people value building, they understood that when the earth was made, however it was made, you don't desecrate it. Nowadays, because everything's made for you, people take every freaking thing for granted. So, the, so, so what do you think is going to happen next? Destruction. And what is the purpose of destruction when you don't have anything? You're going to want to build. You're going to want to have something. You're going to want to start asking questions. How come we don't have this? How come we don't have that? Suffering, community, then building. 
And what comes after building? Appreciation. Appreciation. After everything has been said and done, you learned what the hell appreciation was. Appreciation. Spirituality is about some form of appreciation. Some form. Why are people miserable today? They need to build something. They need to have a purpose. They need to have a purpose. What is your purpose? Why are people destructive today? They don't know what their purpose is. They don't have a passion yet. But right now, their passion is destruction. But some things have to be destroyed so we know what to build. But that's not the case in, in the cities. That stuff was already built for people to enjoy. Like what? Sneakers and all this other stuff. Okay, this is a bit of a sidebar thing. You know, all going off to the side. The sneakers that you stole, they manufacture the stuff with, for $10 and they sell it for $300. Let that one sink in for yourself. That's some of those shoes. That stuff is dirt cheaply made and they're, they're selling it to you at a higher price. In other words, they weren't supposed to have value in the first place. They give you the illusion of value for freaking shoes. It's an illusion. So do your research on that. See if I'm telling the truth. All right. So what did we say? Spirituality is what? Suffering. Okay community building then appreciation those four those are the top four pillars of spirituality that's what they should be unless you want to add a fifth pillar a sixth pillar and and any other pillars you want to add those are the top four those are the top four right now that's what we're dealing with first of all what it what it should have been i, I got five pillars for you we're going to change that one is suffering knowledge of self then community then building then appreciation then appreciation in general appreciation that's what it should be all right you have an excellent day